Is the Blessed Legion of Fakov any good in patch 5.2? Now, I was fairly calm about the Scorpion Legion one, but this, this is an amazing unit because it is a force multiplier, making your entire army better in one key way. And not to beat around the bush, it comes down to Armor Sundering. Taking 30 points of armor off of your enemies using skeleton arrows helps a lot, especially to make other skeleton archers more effective. Going back to the beginning, the hit points and other base stats are largely the same as the Skeleton Archers. Armor is 30 rather than 20, raising this Legion to the lofty heights of mediocrity, and beyond this, range is 160 rather than 140, so the Armor Sundering begins at a little further out than usual. This does not outrange crossbowmen, but can be a nasty surprise for some missile troops. Total accuracy begins and ends at 40, and so technically the regular units can get it a little higher, and calibration area of 3.5 is a mild but welcome improvement to the spread of the original. But seriously, the rest is the armor sundering. Don't think of this as just a big deal for skeleton archers. It impacts all your missile troops like horse archers, chariots, because to varying extents, they still favor base damage with their missiles. There's also no law that says you can't exploit this with melee troops. All your chariot melee favors base damage, regular foot lords do as well, and so on and so forth. Even heavily armor-piercing favored units will do extra damage from the base damage components unless they're ethereal, and that's limited to Arcan and another Regiment of Renown, basically. So, grab this Regiment of Renown and slot it into pretty much anything, and watch the damage numbers climb. Definitely try to combo this with other armor-reducing abilities or spells, like a near-death Lish Priest's Curse, or a simple Soul Blight from the Lure of Death. Even Ushapti with Great Bows will do a little more damage this way, but more likely you'll rack up the damage against a Scarbrand or a Sun Dragon much faster with your more modest means. It's simple, but it's kind of powerful. Too bad we can only get one, huh? Take care, and have fun turning your blessing into the enemy's curse.